They're gonna show you some of the different engineer types, the median entry level salary. That's an entry level salary. That's ridiculous. You need to understand these technical terms and they're gonna break it down for you super simply. They're gonna walk you through building two actual apps. So you're gonna build a voting app and you're gonna build an SEO analyzer. The faster you can go through these foundations, the quicker you'll become one of the most in-demand people in the entire world. In this video, we're gonna be answering the age-old question, the question that everybody's asking, how to learn and master AI quickly. I get this question all the time. I have my own subreddit called Learn AI Agents. I get this question all the time, which is how to learn AI fundamentals. This video is gonna walk you through every single step of how to learn AI, what you need to learn, and then give you free courses, free tutorials, everything you need to become a master. This video was for one of three people. You are either one, a complete beginner, you just started using ChatGPT. This video is also for people who wanna get a true W-2 job. If you wanna actually get a full-time job as a machine learning engineer, getting paid over $100,000, this video is gonna show you what you need to learn. Or if you're somebody who wants to be a true AI entrepreneur, if you wanna start your own automations agency, your own AI agent agency, and actually sell businesses, entrepreneurs on automation services, this video is also going to walk you through how you can become a master. So without further ado, let's go ahead and slide into it. So this first one, AI for Everyone, is the first course you should do if you're a beginner. It's a short six hour course that can easily take you from zero to one in terms of AI. And you can see the curriculum here in terms of what is data, the terminology of AI, what makes an AI company. This was my favorite chapter. Everybody's going to call themselves an AI company in the future, but like what actually are you doing with your data? How are you actually inputting data, analyzing it, using data engineers, et cetera, to truly make yourself this company that's 10xing the output, working like they have 100x the labor. Regardless of who you are in your journey, it would benefit you to take this and start here. Next up, we're gonna go to Elements of AI. This is a free self-paced course by the University of Helsinki. This is gonna help you supplement and truly build the full foundations that you honestly were missing out and didn't get from that first course. This one is a little bit more technical. That's why I put this one second. It's gonna to talk to you about probability fundamentals, the Bayes rule. It's gonna to talk to you about linear regression. These are all highly, highly important things that regardless if you wanna be a no-code developer or especially if you wanna be an AI or machine learning engineer, you need to understand these technical terms and they're gonna break it down for you super simply. The more serious you can take these foundational courses, the faster you'll be on your journey. These are in purposeful order. The next one is all about vibe coding. Regardless of who you are, like I said before, you're gonna to need to understand vibe coding because a lot of what you're gonna be doing is using GPT, Codex, Claude Code to code and build apps, web apps, mobile apps, even automations for you. This course is amazing. It's Vibe Coding 101 with Replit. Replit is super similar to Cursor or Codex where it's just an agentic coding platform. And this one is one of my favorites because I don't just believe in learning for the sake of fucking learning. Like let's actually build something. They're gonna walk you through building two actual apps. So you're gonna build a voting app and you're gonna build an SEO analyzer app. So. They're gonna literally walk you straight through how to vibe code your first two apps, debug, et cetera. And in the future, you're only gonna have more and more help from agentic coding. You know, it's not gonna be like you're gonna have less coding agents in the future. So you need to get used to using them and understand where they might mess up and where you need to go in and improve things, especially with design. After that, you're gonna to wanna to do this introduction to agents course. This is amazing if you're just wondering how to build AI agents what goes into it. This is a very, very full, robust course by Hugging Face that really walks you through these different agentic frameworks that you're probably not gonna see just being talked about on YouTube by young creators. These are more technical agentic frameworks that on the job, like actual W2 $100,000 plus playing jobs, they are consistently looking for people who are proficient with Llama index, Lang graph especially, et cetera. And as you can see, all these are very distinct. We're not learning redundancies. All these are very different in terms of first you're gonna do your fundamentals, 
then you're going to do vibe coding then you're going to go to ai agents all this is very purposeful and strategic and outside of that for foundations the next thing is this ibm ai academy ibm and their videos are really focusing on how ai impacts business strategy so if you're not somebody who just wants to learn, like I said before, just for the fucking sake of learning, this playlist is great for you to consistently be watching, take notes on, so you can truly understand how enterprise level businesses interact with AI, which is gonna be very important if, one, you're trying to get a job at enterprises, so then you can speak to, you know, I understand how you use AWS. I understand how you store and use your cloud solutions, et cetera. But also if you're an entrepreneur, you can really speak to and understand how enterprises use AI so you can apply that knowledge to selling to different businesses as an entrepreneur. So that's everything for phase one in terms of your foundations. I purposely layered a lot here because once you get these core building blocks, the rest of it is just the extra sauce. The rest of it is just the extra that you add on top of it based on what way you wanna go once you go through all these different foundational tutorials, all these foundational resources that are all free, by the way, there's nothing stopping you from dramatically changing your life and living full time off of AI. So next up here, AI agents will take over the future. I don't need to tell you this. I don't need to remind you this. We could easily. This is literally GatesNotes.com. It's Bill Gates' personal blog. And you can see here, he talks about the future of agents and how literally Agents are not only going to change how everyone interacts with computers, but it's going to upend the software industry as a whole. So understanding AI agents is going to be something that the most valuable in demand people understand. And everybody else who thinks it's just a fad will get left behind. I build AI agents like these all the time. This one specifically here is a company investigator that helps you find, identify, research and close leads. This full breakdown and automation will be in my school community. You can check the link in the description for that, but that's for another time. Let's get back to the video. So in phase two, to truly learn, understand, and master agentic systems, you're going to want to take these courses here. And this one is all about MCPs. And for people who don't understand what MCPs are, it's a jargon term. Let's be for real. Modern AI apps need to integrate external data sources to be powerful. So as you can see here, this AI agent is really just instructions that's it but it needs these tools to actually work and do things for you it needs Claude it needs perplexity so when they say MCP they're just referring to the fact that that model context MCP stands for model context protocol and these tools and models you give it are what gives it the context that it needs to actually perform the actions that you give in these instructions so back to, so you're going to want to go and take this course about MCPs and building rich context AI apps with purposely I purposefully picked this Anthropic video specifically because like you can see here, I do use Anthropic to connect to my AI. And obviously, once you take this course and understand MCPs and build and deploy your own MCP service, you can take that to whatever LLM or whatever platform you want to do. As you can see here, just a simple agentic AI engineer search on LinkedIn. The jobs are clearly here. The demand is clearly here for agentic AI specialists to make over $100,000. Great money to support your family. Agentic AI engineer. Clearly, you can see it's also multi-niche. It's not like you would just be working in one specific type of company. You can see this one here is for a nonprofit working to unlock the ocean sustainable potential. This one is for the National Fair Housing Alliance. So... A lot of different niches are already seeing they need agentic AI engineers and is clearly profitable and in demand. So to me, this is a non-negotiable skill that everybody needs who wants to make a living off of AI. There might be hundreds of views on this video. There might be thousands of views. But as you guys know, a small percentage of people truly go out there and take action and watch these. So if you're one of those people that really goes through this you're gonna be one of the most in-demand AI engineers, the better. But let's keep moving. So phase three is the C in face, which is career and certifications, AKA secure your bag. If you're somebody who is in favor of landing a W-2 full-time role, listen, I completely understand it. There is absolute benefit to it because like that word I just said, benefits, health insurance, dental insurance. If you're somebody who wants that stability, there's no problem whatsoever with getting a job as an AI engineer, and this is how you're gonna do it. 
firstly going into it, here are the specialized certifications that you're going to want to do to really be job ready. This first one is the Google Cloud Professional Machine Learning Engineering Certificate. So this one is great because everything I just showed you before, all the foundations, all the agentic systems, it'll all lead up to this. Once you learn those foundations and fundamentals, taking this is going to be clockwork. And yes, there is a $200 fee, but obviously you can make literally a thousand X this if you land a role and you will land a role if you use AI to tailor your resume, apply for more jobs, etc. And like you see here, it does not directly assess coding skill. If you have a minimum proficiency in Python and cloud, you should be able to interpret any questions with code snippets. You can see this exam is going to assess your ability to architect low code AI solutions scale prototypes in the machine learning models, automate and orchestrate machine learning pipelines, collaborate within and across teams. Everything we showed you before was showing you this core thing. And if you're not a fan of Google, you can take this AWS certified machine learning specialty where obviously you can come on here, schedule your exam. This one is 65 questions. You know, who should take this exam? If I were you, I would ignore this top part. Two or more years of experience you can fast forward and compress two years into three to six months of intentional study. But the main thing they're looking for is validating a candidate's ability to design, build, deploy, optimize, train, tune, and maintain machine learning solutions. But as you can notice this last part, forgiven business problems by using the AWS cloud. So a lot of businesses, a lot of enterprises use AWS cloud but luckily, you were paying attention during that IBM playlist and you understand how enterprises use machine learning. Everything is stair-stepping your way to these certifications to become ready for these jobs that I showed you before. These machine learning engineer jobs, I literally just clicked the first one I saw and clearly they're in demand and they're paying well. And so obviously it's going to be competitive to get these jobs. I'm not guaranteeing you that you're going to get a job as soon as you learn these things but you will absolutely have a leg up. And if you're creative with how you're applying, if you're applying to 50 to 100 jobs a day with an AI agent that can tailor your resume on auto, tailor your cover letter on auto, and you have a nice LinkedIn, there's no reason whatsoever you won't get interviews. And so if you wanna get a job as an agent, take AI engineer, like I was talking about before, you're gonna to wanna to go and take this certification here by IBM. So you're gonna be implementing function calling, RAG and vector stores. So. All these terms may sound unfamiliar to you now, but if you go through all those initial foundational resources and free tutorials, there's no excuse. You're going to understand all these like the back of your hand. They're going to show you some of the different engineer types, the median entry level salary. That's an entry level salary. That's ridiculous. And entirely, I made a different video about how to earn the top 1% in AI where I did a deep study. And what I really found out other than these pay grades being insane, other than machine learning engineers getting a cool 327,000 from Instacart, you know, between the base salary and the different equities and bonuses, et cetera. Other than that, the real reason that these people are getting paid so much money is because of this. You're, if you understand this, you're in limited supply because these skills barely existed five years ago but they're now considered some of the most strategic assets for a company and an enterprise to have. So that's why there's not like this huge supply and inflow of people who are talented because there was nobody pushing this training in 2018 and 2017. So that's why you're not behind at all. You're actually ahead. You're ahead of the race. The faster you can go through these foundations, the quicker you'll become one of the most in demand people in the entire world. But let's just say, you know, the W2 corporate route isn't for you. I don't blame you. Let's just say you want to create your own schedule. Let's just say you're self enterprising and you just want to work with small businesses. If you really want to truly master and understand and learn this, you've already went through the foundations. You've learned about agentic systems. Now you want to go ahead and master N8N, which is going to be a breeze. It's going to be simple for you because N8N is already a no code platform. All of these things you're seeing in here would normally take a hundred plus lines of custom code. For me to get database pages in Notion would really have taken so much Python code, so much API interaction, where now I can just come in here, choose multi-select natural language options that make it super simple. I can come in here and control the AI agent by putting in a natural language prompt. 
Yes, there's a bit of JSON, but after you go through the foundations, JSON for you is going to be just as legible as plain English. That's going to be your next step is going to Nick Sarayev's playlist because he's not only going to show you how to use N8N, he's going to show you how to build a full agency around it. He's going to show you how to figure out who to sell to, how to price, how to do the actual outreach, etc. So he's got it fully built out to the point where I don't need to regurgitate and do it myself. So if you want to learn about N8N and how to actually become an entrepreneur with no code and low code automations, just go ahead and watch this playlist. Obviously, it's free. It's got everything you need in there. And in addition to that, if you want to just get in there, play around, continue to learn by building, this is linked in this Notion page as well. This is just a full GitHub repo full of AI automations that you can plug into JSONs. This is full of N8N JSON templates. So if you're not used to GitHub, if you haven't seen GitHub before, this is going to be the probably the most important portfolio and just overall website for you where you can find templates of what's already working so you don't need to rebuild things. If you want to learn more about GitHub and just fully master it, I have a full module on it in my school community. Link to that is in the description. But just to show you in, I think I want to find a cold DM automation. Yeah, I age it for Instagram DM. Come in here and as you can see, this might look unfamiliar, but this is all just JSON. So if I literally come up here, download so now that I've downloaded this, I can literally come in my N8N. I can save my whole workflow. Don't need to be deleting that. All my workflows got deleted before. That was a sad day. But I can come up here, just literally import from file, AI agent for Instagram. And as you can see, now I fully have his JSON template inside of my N8N. And instead of creating everything from scratch, you can be more efficient and start from people's templates. So. If you want all of my templates in N8N, obviously you can go to my school. I'm also going to be hosting a full five day day workshop on how to build your first AI agent, how to land a job, etc. If you are, so if you want to bring your own automation projects in N8N or make, if you just have questions, if you're a business owner, etc., come to this live workshop. Feel free to ask any questions. I'm going to be doing screen sharing. You can hop on screen share, whatever we need to do to get you fully 100% finished with an output that can help your business or your career in the next